welcome welcome again to this channel life with jennifer jm and i am your girl auntie jen and how are you doing my viewers and my subscribers in this video we're going to look at my viewers and you know russian brown is it russian or richard brown whatever her name is in this case as apologize confessed and he apologized and he sent out a message by his attorney to us as the Jamaican people and if those of you were following my teaching on the each morning this week we were actually on the topic of forgiveness and when I said to us and a lot of people some on the live may not even understand that when I said forgiveness comes both ways now this is this is real i believe i believe his confession is real and i believe his apology is real we can differ in our beliefs on that for the mere fact that he sent a letter out by his attorney to say to the media i am asking you i am sorry that's the first thing i am sorry for my involvement in taking the life of the baby and our mother and I'm asking all Jamaica to forgive me and I'm asking the family to forgive me now if someone done something to you and come to you in a manner like this I know somebody you're gonna come on here you're gonna say it differently but I just have to tell you how it works you have no other way to work out it than to forgive because he asked for forgiveness and because he asked for forgiveness you have to forgive regardless of the circumstances however you forgiving him will not makes a difference from him after still pay the penalty for what he has done so I'm going to take you into the clip so you can hear the message directly from his lawyer. Listen to this. I can see it's not our client has been the PTP, he was sentenced to 30 years in prison. But as it relates to the proceedings, I am not able to have a discussion with you. The note that I have, he says, I just want to do the right thing. I want my lawyer to tell the family of the baby and mother and the Jamaican public that I am very sorry for the loss of their lives. I want my lawyer to also tell my mentor that I'm very sorry for the disappointment. I hope one day everyone will find it possible to forgive me. And he signs his name to it. The mentor? He didn't mention the mentor. Anything else you can add at this time? There were some other charges. What were the sentences? Oh, he was charged with two and two counts of kidnapping. So the other sentencing, um, sentences were kidnapping, uh, two counts. And those will not count currently with the 30 years. Uh, it was uh, for the kidnapping, one year and 10 months. At this time, what I can say. So there you have it, my viewers and my subscriber. You hear it for yourself, what he has said, and boy, I, I sometimes when I think about this thing, I don't even know how this could have been avoided. You know, this could have been avoided 
if Leola was thinking consciously, knowing that it wouldn't worth what she was doing. And even if she didn't get caught, she, or, or conscience, was she planning that if she didn't get away, she would take the plane, go back to the US, and then come back down and come, come comfort Mr. Phillips and say, oh, so sorry you lost your baby and all of that, and then lay down in the bed with him and make back love with him. What's that you're thinking, Leola Bradshaw? Sorry if that was your thinking, because if that was your thinking, it just didn't work out. And right where you are now, now you must hear the news now and thinking what will be your your own demise some of you are my subscriber the conversation continue because we have more to say about this but i want you to leave your views and your comment do you believe that we all should forgive mr brown making an apology and firstly he did confessed and he's now asking for us to forgive him should we forgive him leave your comments like the video and share and if you have not yet subscribed to this channel life with jennifer jm subscribe and turn on that notification bell whenever we go live or upload a video you'll be the first to be notified i'm your girl auntie jen bye